These are the unlawful Bristow and Sutter. I'm going to talk to Richard Surrock. Or Sally Lake. What's it regarding, sorry? It's personal. Well, Sally Leach is name and yeah. they won't talk to you in person, you'd have to ring them. Is it your account, is it? It's not my account, no. Is it somebody else's account? I'm here advocating I am. Sorry? I'm advocating. What so, I mean, I'm here off somebody else, basically. Oh, you're on somebody, yeah. 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 If you go across, because right, Mr. Richard Suter won't deal with it anyway. If you go across that building over there where it says Bristol and Suter, yeah. Okay. They might get back to get somebody to talk All right, to cheers, you. thank All you. Right, right, okay. but he won't talk about an account with you at all. Yeah. Just to let you know, I am here and I did just hear that. And so did the camera. That's not you? No. Very No. Is that your address? No. I have uh, been authorised as an advocate to obviously bring that in. That's the fraudulent document used as uh, the warrant of control to steal his car. Right. So I've just come to present this evidence to you, obviously, that uh, this is why I wanted to talk to Richard Sturry, um or one of the directors, because it's more that it's them that's liable, not you. Um, that is uh, actually registered to a corporation called A1 Recovery, yet it's the truck that you used to steal the car. Um, I spoke to the owner of A1 Recovery and he said it's not the first time this has happened. Um, so, that's okay. for And that's the driver of the car. The vehicle registration here? Yes. Is that your car? That's, uh, no, that's a man who I am here advocating for. Right, okay. And that's not Barry Hicks? What's not Barry Hicks? Who owns that car? Yes. Yeah, okay. So, okay. So, I'm basically here to tell you that he wants a car back. It is um, part of an ongoing public inquiry. Um, all men and women that are complicit in illegal entrapment can and will be exposed. Um, okay, just bear me one second. No worries. Yeah, I know, I understand. So, the, what, the situation that we have is that um, you've seized this Barry Hicks' car. Yeah, this gentleman is an advocate for Barry, Barry Hicks and he's come to this. Not to represent him kind of thing. Um, while there might not be authorisation on here to allow us to speak to him, we just we need clarity. So I'm just going to go and get Pauline. See what she says. Okay. Right. Thank you. I'll be just be one second. Okay. Cheers. Hello. Yeah. Okay. Can I have your name, please? Yeah, it's Alison. Alison. Okay. Um, basically here because. Obviously, you've used this uh, fraudulent document to steal a car, um, and the car that, well, the truck that the car was taken on is this recovery truck here, um, and that is actually registered to a corporation called A1 Recovery. Mm -hmm. The owner of that corporation hasn't got a clue uh, about any of this. Um, this is the driver of the truck. Okay. Um, and this was the agent working on. Yeah. Uh, so obviously, um, that being fraudulent, you've basically stolen the car. In what way do you say that this is fraudulent? It's fraudulent, as in the. Um, well, it's been investigated as part of a public inquiry and it's evidence that it's fraudulent. So the building that authorised it was Northampton County Court mm -hmm. 
and he's actually spoken to the man who authorised it and he then told us that he nor anyone else in that building is legally trained. So how can they authorise a warrant of control if they aren't legally trained? Who, who is it that you've spoken to at the Traffic Enforcement Centre? It's the manager. It's not Traffic Enforcement Centre, Northamptonshire County, County Court. Court, yeah. And that's okay, the so manager, Adrian. the name of the person that you spoke to there? That was Adrian. Adrian. He's the manager. Obviously, th this is... Um, I'm just here to verbally confirm these notices because he has sent three notices so far to yourselves. So I'm just here now, so um, you can't try and say that you weren't made aware. Um, obviously all corporations are colluding in legal entrapment and every man and woman um, that is complicit with it will and well can and will be exposed. Okay, and, and you work for? I'm just a man, member of the public, it's a public know. inquiry, yeah. Right, okay. self publicised And you're um, acting on behalf of Mr Hicks? I'm advocating for Barry. Right, okay. No problem. And did just hear you say that you've got something with your name? Uh, actually, this is how I identify myself. Yeah, that's fine, yeah. Well, am I able to keep that? Or? No, 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 I'll, I'll need that back, obviously. That back. You can read that, that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Um, I mean... There isn't any information that I can give you. Uh, no, obviously, it, he has sent the notices. I'm just here today as part of the public inquiry. Obviously, um, it, it will be added to all the evidence that we've already gathered. Mm -hmm. um, because, well, it's time colluding corporations stopped asset stripping the public of their property. Um, so I just want that on as well. Are you happy to keep yeah, you keep them. Um, obviously, you have already got them because. Um, so obviously, so the court, Northamptonshire Court, authorised that warrant of control, and then at the scene, the officer said that the warrant of control was lawful. It's since been proven it wasn't. Um, he has since tried to say that the warrant of control that we have got is not the one that he saw on the day. Um, so obviously we have got you. To, yeah, yeah. So then we got you to send the police officer the warrant of control, which is the exact same one. Um, well, you're basically just tripping yourselves up every corner. Okay. Well, what I'll do is I'll go and take a copy of this, mm -hmm. um, and obviously it's recorded by yourself yeah. that, that I've taken the copy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cheers.